Pension protection is something that we have to put at the top of our priority list. A disturbing new investigation suggests the Obama administration may have sacrificed benefits for some 20,000 non-union retirees to save the pensions of union employees. Delphi and the Pension Benefit Guarantee Corporation were forced to terminate Delphi's pension plans, which means that there are Delphi retirees who unfortunately will collect less than their full pension benefits. If you work hard and play by the rules, then you've earned your pension. The president was concerned about the unions and he discounted the salary workforce. I'd like to know why the salaried employees got chopped up so badly. It doesn't seem fair. Bankruptcy laws are more focused on protecting banks than protecting pensions. And I don't think that's fair. As a non-union employee of Delphi, I lost 33% of my pension my medical benefits, and my life insurance. As a result of the Obama administration's actions in the takeover of General Motors, I lost my pension, my health care, and my life insurance. General Motors is alive! GM may be alive, but I'm struggling. GM may be alive, but I personally am hurting. Pension protection is something that we have to put at the top of our priority list.